In this video, I want to demonstrate how to make a basic section view. Section views allow internal and hidden features to be properly viewed and dimensions. To properly show the depth and shape of these cutouts, I'll need a section view. To create one, from the drawing ribbon, I'll select section view. Then over here, I can tell if I want a full section or a half section. I just want to do a basic full section. So next I choose my cutting line style and I'll go with this one, number one, make a vertical cutting line through the, my part. Then I'll come over to the view I would like the section view in and click to place it. Once I've done that, I can add to the section view. I can add some offsets. For my purposes, this section view cutting through the middle of the part will be fine. So I'll say, okay. Then I'll move over here and click to place the section view. I can flip its direction with this. I can change the call out with this. So I'll make this section AA. I can choose how I would like the section view to look, whether it's partial or sliced, add auto hatching. I'll just scroll down. I can also change the depth here. And I don't want the annotations to come in. I want to add those separately later. So I'll uncheck the import annotations. Then I'll say OK, and I've created a simple section view cutting through the middle of my part here. Now SolidWorks will have added the thread callout again from the cosmetic thread. So I'm going to select it and delete it because I don't want this in more than one view. Now that I've created a section view, I'll just zoom in here, I can properly see the details of these features cut into the top of the part.